I'm Peter Norris. I'm the biographer of the artist Arthur Henry Knighton Hammond. This is a continental work by Knighton Hammond, painted in the 1920s. It's probably Monton in the south of France where he lived. You can see he mastered the techniques of the Impressionists uh, during this period. Uh, he'd learned that from Adolphe Follette when he studied at Manchester Municipal School of Art. He picked up on all the techniques of the Impressionist, the colour, the light, the tone, and here's a great example of these uh, figures painted at lightning speed, giving great spontaneity and movement. And everywhere there's a, a personal story being told by the figures as they uh, are out speaking to each other in little clusters. And the architecture, there's no great detail in the architecture, but you can see it, you can read it, it's that impression that he creates of it. And again, if you look closely, it's just uh, lots of colour, lots of tone. But when you get back from it, it all blends into place. It all creates that uh, great impressionist of what you see before you. Great illusion. He was a great illusionist with the, the uh, impressionist technique. This would have been painted all plein air, actually on the spot. Great spontaneity. And it probably took him 20 minutes, maybe half an hour to, to produce this. Again, pure direct uh, watercolour, no underdrawing in pencil. Just sat before him, watercolour brush in hand, painted this scene. Superb impressionist. 